Hi guys, it's me, your biology facilitator, Dr. Seema Sharma, and you are watching my YouTube channel, BioHub. Dear friends, my this video is about twins. Yes, twins. Twins have the ability to instantly grab your attention, whether they are there in your school campus, college campus, cafeteria, or you have seen them in some market or in some social gathering. The moment you see similar looking twins, you start thinking, what had made them to appear exactly carbon copy of each other? On the other hand, if you come across twins which hardly resemble each other, then you become curious. You want to know, how is it possible? So I'm here to answer your most of the queries related to twins with the help of a comparative account of identical and non-identical twins. Identical twins are similar looking twins and non-identical twins are also known with another name that is fraternal twins. But before making a comparative account of these two type of twins, let's know who are called twins. When two embryos develop simultaneously in the uterus of a mother and two offsprings or babies are born to that mother in same pregnancy, then those babies are called twins. Now let's make a comparative account of identical and fraternal twins. First parameter is about number of eggs and sperms involved. In case of identical twins, a single egg gets fertilized by a single sperm. On the other hand, in case of fraternal twins, two separate eggs get fertilized by two different sperms. Coming to the time of fertilization, in case of identical twins, fertilization occurs within 24 hours of conception. On the other hand, fertilization time of both eggs is generally not the same in case of fraternal twins. Third parameter is medical terminology. In medical terms, identical twins are called as monozygotic twins because they are made up from a single zygote which later splits into two embryos. And this is the pictorial representation of the same process. In contrast to this, the medical term for fraternal twins is dizygotic twins because they are made up of two separate zygotes. And here is the pictorial representation of the formation of dizygotic twins. Next comparative account is about placenta and amniotic sac. Before comparing, let me first clarify the meaning of these two terms. Placenta is a temporary organ that develops in pregnant ladies. It attaches itself to the endometrium of the uterus and supplies oxygen and nutrients through the umbilical cord to the developing embryo. On the other hand, amniotic sac is a pouch-like or bag-like sac that surrounds the developing fetus during pregnancy. Identical twins, they share same placenta but they can have separate or same amniotic sac. And same is clear in this picture, this maroon colored structure is placenta. One placenta, it is shared by two developing fetus, but they are enveloped in two separate amniotic sacs in this case. Whereas in case of fraternal twins, they always have separate placenta and separate amniotic sac. So here you can see there are two placenta and two amniotic sacs. Next contrasting feature is about the fetal membrane development. So here you're going to know about the two membranes basically which makes the embryo sac. The outer one is called as chorion and the inner one is called as amnion. Identical twins may share a chorion and or amnion. This point will be more clear with the help of this diagrammatic representation. In first picture, the monozygotic twins are monochorionic and diamniotic. On the other hand, monozygotic twins may have monochorionic and monoamniotic coverings. In contrast to this, fraternal twins always have separate chorions and amnions and these are very clear in this diagrammatic representation. Next point of reference is about genetic similarity. Identical twins are almost 100% identical in term of DNA. On the other hand, in case of fraternal twins, they share about 50% of their genetic material like any other sibling. Coming to the heritability of traits, identical twins, they are more similar in term of physical and behavioral traits due to their identical genetic makeup. See, in contrast to this, Paternal twins show the typical variation seen in any other non-twin siblings because they only share about 50% of their genes. So they may or may not be similar in terms of physical and behavioral traits. Next contrasting feature is appearance. Identical twins, they often look very similar in appearance, just like mirror images of each other and 
they even manage to confuse everyone around them. On the other hand, fraternal twins can look similar or quite different like regular siblings. Next point is about sex congruency. They are always of the same sex, either two sisters or two brothers. In contrast to this, fraternal twins, they can be of same sex or they can be of different sexes like two brothers, two sisters or even one sister and one brother. Next contrasting feature is genetic contribution to IQ. Generally, a higher correlation in IQ between monozygotic or identical twins is seen. It can be a plus point for the twins. If one is intelligent, another will be equally intelligent. On the other hand, the correlation in IQ is typically lower in dizygotic twins. Coming to the chances of development of chromosomal abnormalities. So in case it's the minus point of identical twins, if one twin has a chromosomal abnormality, the other is likely to have it as well. Whereas the fraternal twin siblings may or may not get affected by the chromosomal abnormality. Last contrasting feature is about incidence in population. Identical twins, they are less common. Just 3 to 4 out of every 1000 births. Whereas the fraternal twins are more common and their incidents are about 23 in every 1000 births. So that's it about the contrasting features of identical twins and fraternal twins. And here is the tabulated account of all those 12 points of differences which we have just discussed between these two type of twins. Now, I'm sure that by simply looking at the twins, you will be able to make out which one are monozygotic twins and which one are dizygotic twins. But hold on viewers, there is a catch. All these twins which are present in this picture, they belong to twin village of Kerala. It's in Malapuram district and name of this village is Kodani. And you will be surprised to know here the incidence of twins is 42 per 1000 births. With this, it's time to wind up this video. Thank you so much for watching this video and supporting Biohub. Take care. Bye-bye.